Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Seven Days to Die, No Blood Moon. I'm the Radio Man 03, and it's awesome to have you along. Check it out. There's Variety. She's just hanging out with us. Just kind of hovering around the base. <laughs> it's so cool. I guess when she has to, she could just clip through some things, right? And she does just fine then. She doesn't get stuck. There are two wildfires burning in the area. Two of them. And it's a red flag day, which means it's super hot and um, super dry and super windy is what it means. Dry and windy. So I thought that was kind of interesting. Oh, I should have copied that. R. I give up. I can't find the dang things. I can't find them. <laughs> Seriously. I could not. I've looked everywhere. You guys will tell me exactly where it is, but I have looked back and forth on that dang chart for that block, that arrow slit, and I've not found it. So if I do this right here, I'm thinking maybe what I do is something like this right here, and that's what we use to uh, maybe wedge the bike into a little bit. Oh, that works out perfect too, just like that, huh? Yeah, somebody had the idea of using the arrow slit so with the, the groove that comes back on it, you could park your tires in between it, but I think that'll work just fine. It keeps it standing straight up too. Let's uh, upgrade it. God, I wonder if I'm gonna cause any problems with it like that. I wonder if I need to have her flying around with me all the time. What do you think? I'm not so sure I do need her all of the time. Oh. I think that's her. I think she's banging into stuff. I've got a little bit of wood on me. I think that's... Oh, that's exactly what I needed to go out and do today, huh? Yes, we talked about this last episode. We'll do this one here, too. And this one here. There we go. Perfect. Just like that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, a little parking space for the uh, for the hog carnage there. Mm-hmm. A little parking space. Let's go ahead and throw that back in there. Um, okay, so, yeah. I need trees. I need some trees. Oh, and I know exactly where to go for the trees this go-round. I've got the saw on me. Repair kits as well. Uh, and I think... I think, I, yep, I've got a bunch of fuel on me too. Oh, perfect. As we were coming back from our last jaunt out there into the world where we nearly, I mean nearly, died. Um, yeah, that, that's... We, I found an area where we have some trees that need to be uh, taken care of. Uh, I can make the powered stuff. So we do need to get busy on this. I wasn't sure if I could make the reinforced drawbridge powered and the garage doors powered, but I can make those. So that is, um, that's something we need to think about. I need to think about what I want to do with the gate. How's this going to work when the zombies come up to it? Last time we had some electric fences, which was really fun. Um, and a few other uh, little traps that were set up to the side. I figured guns. I think I was talking about putting maybe blade traps on at least these two corners right here so as they come up the staircases, they get chopped a little bit as they're coming around. Something like that. Uh, that's kind of my thoughts anyways. Yeah, so there are two wildfires burning here. Today is a red flag day, which means humidity is like nothing. And uh, we have 45 to 50 mile an hour winds going on right now. Yeah, 45 to 50 mile an hour winds. And there's a fire, and it's just in the right path of a, a bunch of houses two of them like that and it's just unbelievable to me it's only april it's only april right over here i mean look at this man yeah you see i i've, I've got a ton of trees here variety there will warn me if somebody is coming up on me how how big are these they don't look very big do they oh they're good okay be back oh i've got a bad feeling about this <laughs> <laughs> Knock her down. <laughs> gotcha. My senses have picked up something. Is it dropping a two now, baby? <laughs> Your senses. Your spidey senses are picking something up. Where's my bike? Where's my, where's my motorcycle? There it is. There it is. 
I'm still chopping down trees, but uh, the occasional zombie comes by, and you know the interaction is always uh, enjoyable when it comes to uh, one of these little meatheads. I thought maybe by using the chainsaw like that, real fast, that maybe I'd call in a witch. But master, we are not alone. Yes, I see. <laughs> so I see. Right. Yeah. You are 100% correct, my dear. Um, okay, I'm, I'm still gathering wood. I've got a little over a stack right now, so we're doing pretty good. I don't think I'm going to plant the oaks. I'm just kind of slapping down once I clear out an area. I don't know. I think I've shown you guys this before. What was that? It sounded like a crawler, didn't it? Something. There's a couple of zombies out here wanting to cause some trouble. I thought we heard like two different zombies there for a second. Oh, here we go. Well, here, here's the crawler. It's a good time. Okay, so back to my motorcycle and uh, gonna find some more trees to chop down. You know, get some more wood. I think I want two stacks. So I was thinking about our adventure last episode going into the waste. Thank you, Variety. I'm ready. I'm prepared, my dear. Here we go. Whack. Whack-a-mole. I missed him both times. I don't think I hit his head once. Uh, now nah, I'm just messing around. I, I don't have a silent mode. I don't have a silent mode that I can utilize to sneak. I have no sneak ability. So I'm thinking maybe the heavy armor with um, uh, some of the mods in it that make you sneakier. <laughs> Might be a good route for me. Oh, we got an airdrop over here, it looks like. Cool. Let's go get that. I wonder how long that's been there. I didn't even notice it. We're heading back for the bike. I'll just plant what I can right here. I'm going to take some loot along the way. And I'm going to drop you... And you, because I get plenty of them every time I come out. Let's go get that airdrop and see what that's all about. Sounds like fun. Oh, is it up on the house, maybe? Nah. Maybe? Nah. Maybe? Nah. <laughs> no, it's way past this house. Get real, radio. Get real. It's up in the sky. What's it doing way up there? <laughs> That's a weird thing to have happen, huh? Hmm. Maybe if I remove this tree? Oh, oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I think we lost it. I think somehow it was attached to that tree or something. Bugged out in the tree, maybe? Master, we are not alone. Thank you. Right in the kisser. Right in the big smooch. Yeah, I, uh, I think that um, kind of ruined it. I think that ruined that package. Too bad. Let's take a couple of those. Let's take this right here. Beautiful. We'll scrap that right there. We'll scrap that right there. And boom. We're right as rain. Not quite perfect, but... We're doing just fine. Okay, there's my two stacks of wood. I am on my way back home. I will meet you there, and we will figure out what is next on the agenda today. Because mission accomplished. Oh! Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? I've got me? a bad feeling about this. Oh, I didn't even see her right there. I heard her, but I didn't see her. That's weird, huh? We had an airdrop disappear in a tree. It's almost like they're like, Hey, man, we're real sorry about that. We're going to send you down another one. Special delivery. I was like, All right. Oh, man. That's pretty sweet, huh? <laughs> yeah, we got your back, buddy. We're so sorry that landed in that tree and disappeared on you. We don't know why those things vanish like that. 
<clears throat> Damn that damn Copperfield. Let's go. Oh, we're gonna beat it to the ground. Nice. Get to see it come in on his parachute. We'll run Lois over here too while we're at it. Woohoo! Oh, poor Lois. Poor, poor Lois. Hmm. She doesn't even know where we are. Look at this variety. Mm hmm. Special delivery. Just for us. Because our last order, our last drop got screwed up. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh, we got range mods bundle. Mm. Okay. All right. What do we got here? What's this here? Melee mods bundle. Oh. Okay. Fortifying grip, huh? What does my baseball have on it right now? Oh, the fortifying grip would do what to it? When health is below 50%, gain one hit point every five seconds. Can I put that on the shotgun? See, on the shotgun, I've got the foregrip mod, which is nice because that helps with the, um, the kick and everything. Shotgun tube extended mod. Yeah, I've got that on it. Can I put another one on there? I think I've... Yeah, I've got it modded out. It doesn't say it can go on there anyways. What about the bat? Yeah, I can go on the bat. I kind of figured it as much. But see, I'd have to take one of those off. The weighted head gives me the stun. Metal spikes. I don't know if those help out all that much. If anything else, we could put them in something and sell them, right? Hello? Zombie? Oh, it's Lois. She finally caught up to us. I forgot all about her. Silly Master, lady. we are not alone. No, we're not. Oh, she's gonna burn for a little bit. Oh, she got me. She got me. It's only fair, right? Alright, meet you back at the uh, El Base. Compound. I thought maybe today we might get the uh, other farm put in place so we know exactly what we're dealing with structurally on the building. Oh, baby. Thanks for the other idea, too. I'm sure it works great. I'm sure it does. Uh, but I'll stick with this one. And because I could actually find the blocks. So that was, you know, it came in pretty dang handy. I got to tell you that much. All right, let's put the wood away. Uh, yes, down here is good. We'll keep six. Well, no, we don't have to have 6,000 of that on us. That's just a. Crazy amount. What are we getting? The old. Uh, uh, we got a sight mod. Got an arrow rest mod. We got a few mods, but I'm not interested in putting anything on there. The shotgun is, again, yeah, it's leveled out really good. I, I like the shotgun la uh, loadout. It's good with me. I need to fix a wall back here. I can tell you that much. Throw that in there, and then mods go up in here. So we'll do that, 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 and that. We've got a few things in here that we can actually attach to some weapons and sell. It should be pretty cool. It should be worth it anyways. Uh, some pipes. I got a little bit of rock on me. I keep a little bit of rock on me over there just because you never know when you're going to forget to go get it. And if I always go to that chest. It's like, oh yeah, that's right, because I always throw my little stuff in there. Just the extra little stuff every now and again. Boom, like so. I'm going to put you guys in there. I got 824 of you. Very nice. Oh, wrong way. I need to get a couple more cement mixers going. I'm getting to that point now where I want one for sand, and I want at least one for concrete. Actually, two for concrete and one for sand. So I could drop 6,000 sand into one, uh, you know, uh, cement mixer, and then I can get the uh, equal amounts going in both of the other mixers. And it, uh, it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool to get a bunch of that going like that. Did I not throw these on the ground? I have now. All right, so I'm going to finish getting myself kind of put back together again. It's a little after 1 o'clock in the afternoon. I'm not going to go anywhere today. I do want to make sure I get the um, other farm area ironed out so I know exactly what I'm building and where I can build. We're going to do that right there. I'm going to get something to eat, and then uh, I'll be back. Okay, what's next? What's next on the agenda? Uh, we're going to do the... Um, Maybe it's better to start out here. Let's see. The other farm plot that we need over here. 
I realize it's across the way. It's it's a bit of a distance, but at the same time, I'm, I'm okay with it. Uh, so again, I'm gonna have to remove the top guy here, uh, which I th I don't think I could actually hit it from down here. Okay, so I've got to bust this guy out and the other guy out too. Oh boy. Well, there it is. Can I really hear that? I can't just hear that guy all the way over here, right? No way. Oh no, there's like a horde down Incoming here. Incoming enemies, prepare for conflict. <laughs> There's one way out there. What are you doing way out there? Gotcha. That's Luke. Let's crosshairs close all the way. That's the key, right? You gotta let those crosshairs close all the way so... You know, um... You get the best shot. Oh, he's still coming. He's still coming. Oh, that one got him. Wasted around, but that's okay. Yeah, there we go. All right. Fun. It's always nice when the zombies come to visit. It surely is. So, we're supposed to go one, two, a three, four. Is that five? It's two, three, four. Come all the way down to the here. I'm, I'm pretty sure that's what I did. Did I put a leg on the inside of the wall, or I just go all the way to the wall? Uh, what do we got here? One, two, three, four, five. Oh, you know what? I'm closer. Am I closer to that side than this side? I don't think I am. Maybe I am. Two, three, four, five. Hmm. That's interesting. I don't have as much room over here. Well, that's okay, because then I could just come right here. It's going to look a little different, I guess. Like so. I'll come six. That's okay, right? Five in the middle. One, two, three, four, five, and then up here. Yeah, okay. No, don't worry about me. I'm just having a radio moment. Just having a radio moment, that's all. Uh, let's get you on there. And bring you on over here. Get over here. Boxes. Building with boxes, everybody. And then we need to come across this way. Excuse me, Variety. So this is... I'm a little confused as to why this is not as big as the other side. I, I'm just... I, I guess what I did was I, I built the building, the structure to go with the drawbridge, which I wanted down here at this end of the wall. I don't know. I, I, I don't know. I, I didn't think that far ahead, I guess. I did not do it. Let me bust this out of here. We'll have this done by the end of the episode. I'm thinking about putting the grow plots down in here too, but I'm, I don't know, are, are they considered covered then? If I, if I seal that up and I have grow plots down here, will they be okay? I mean, we've got the side light. And, yeah, they should be okay, right? The side and everything. I should be able to put crop plots down there. I think so. I'm answering my own question before I even finish answering it. <laughs> he is learning, ladies and gentlemen. He is learning by leaps and bounds. You know, I like having the little robot around, I've got to say. It's pretty nice. Okay, I've got some building material. And I think that's all I need is just the wood in this. And I should be okay if I get... Well, you know what? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's grab a couple of those and some of that. Let's do that too. Oh, speaking of which... Uh, I don't need my pickaxe at the moment, so let's grab this guy right here, and let's go R, copy that, and paint that block right there, because somehow that got erased. Uh, see, I've got to go back through, because some of the mistakes I make when I erase them, it seems that it's, you know, had a bit of an impact on some of the paint job down here as well. 
So I've got to go back through the place and just make sure each room has got their stuff uh, the way it's supposed to be. Because, uh, yeah, painting on top of different paintings and stuff. I had to come through here and I put the gray ceiling paint in here all the way around. Uh-huh. Oh, I didn't do it over here yet, but the main hallway and stuff, I was just kind of uh, dabbling in the paint. I like that chipped um, gray, sort of a plaster look too, and I kind of like that a little bit. Okay, so next step is to go upgrade everything. Oh my god, it's just, look at the storm out here. It's ridiculous. I can't catch a break, man. Just trying to make a nice video, you know, and you got this stormy weather all the time. Okay, next step is to copy all these guys and get these moved around. I should probably divide this up. I don't have to do it too many times. We do there, and then we've got to, of course, do the outside of the wall here, too. Uh, but then, yeah, these guys, I've only put these guys up to the cobble. I guess just to tempt fate. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe so. Maybe that's what I'm doing. Uh, just, yeah, I haven't done, I haven't done that. Uh, and then we're going to put, of course, the uh, farm plots down in here. There we go. Just like a so. go perfect and then of course we got to get the upper area too um i'm gonna go ahead and get these other ones set up it's gonna take me a second because it's me doing it but uh i think if i come up here maybe i can get two of these at once oh look at that the next one snapped into place just nicely she's gonna be in the way of this one. <laughs> oh, maybe not oh that's awesome one more to go Nice. Can I upgrade with her there? I sure can. Look at that. Oh, she just makes herself handier, doesn't she? Look at that. They're like, maybe that's my, <laughs> it's probably my gunshots that are causing damage to that right down there, huh? Oh, you guys also said if these are upgraded a little bit, they would uh, work them a little bit better. Let's do that to those right there. And we'll get these, uh, these guys down here too at the very end. On this end, they do seem to get kind of confused, I guess. Oh, and you also said to make sure I block this off. Sometimes she makes a noise that sounds just like a zombie. Something like that right there. We'll just try something like that real quick. Is it good? Is it not good? You know, do they like it? Do they not like it? Do we care? Well, we probably should. A little bit. We'll try these guys right here. If they're on the back of the building, they just kind of work it out eventually, you know? Uh, you know, the other thing we should really work on today, hopefully, and get accomplished, is to have the um, uh, spikes put down. We should get those installed. It's only 4 o'clock. I've got a little bit of time do that and that would probably be a good thing to do well we still have to move the gardens over and I've, I've got to check to see if I, I we've got rails up there to install as well oh good looks like we got them all okay that works for me too perfect uh, the only thing I need to do now is oh uh, nope 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 wait a minute what am I talking about I don't have them all taken care of no I do not I guess I do need to figure out how I'm going to work this out. Maybe I will do all this in sort of this brick along here. You know, it seems like a natural area to kind of have this go. I can have it stop at the runway here, but then I could have it follow it along there just to kind of trim this out. I do need to figure out what, yeah, what, what color do I want this up here to be? So this kind of screws up my farm idea because I don't have quite as much room down here as I thought I was going to have. It's not the same size. Or is it the same size? No, it's, it's not. It's not the same size. Let's get this. Let's, hopefully we got enough paint to do just this. I know I could do a, a larger brush. Sorry. 
And then we just have to put these guys in, right? I have, I've not upgraded any of these bars. Let's copy the rotation. Um, hmm. Yeah, this is the way I want these guys to go. Oh, well, wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. Do I have the bars going out that... I have the bars pointing outwards every time. Okay, that's, that's correct. Okay, good. Oh, that was good. Oops, look at that one. Look at that one there. <laughs> what do you think you're doing? Uh, hold on, let's go ahead and copy... Uh, our rotation, copy rotation. I think that's right. Hmm. I don't think so. I think I've got to go in the other way there. Yeah, I do. No, I need you to be like this. There we go. Perfect. And then I need you to copy you. I guess I'm going to copy the rotation too. There we go. Well, that's upside down. Did not notice that. <laughs> I guess I'm going to have to go through the whole thing. There it is. There it is. Perfect, just like that. And then I need, oh boy, corners. Um, could I do this one? What's this one look like? That gives us an extra bar kind of at the end of the rail here. Oh, that doesn't kind of sit very well right there, but um, I guess I've got to be okay with that. You know, a couple of the pegs are not actually sitting on anything. I guess I could put a piece of trim along there and kind of make that look right underneath. Ooh. What is, there is just like a bar, right? A single bar? We used, yeah, we've used it in the staircases and stuff. Just a single railing. Is that up here? Pillar. Hmm. I'm going to think about that, but I'm pretty sure, yeah, there might be a block that I could put underneath there to clean that up a little bit. And then, then that works for this right here. Now, where are the crops at at the moment? Let's see. The crops. How are the crops? Uh, you guys are actually done. So that is awesome. What we're going to do is we're going to scoop these guys up first, take these downstairs and get them replanted. And then we're going to go grab that other farm and bring it over here. Irregardless of how it fits over here, it's going to be better than having it sitting over there, kind of in the middle of the whole area. Because you're right about landing. You want to have plenty of space. So if I take these out of here, that gives me a little bit of room up here, you know. To kind of come in and if I get squirrely, I could be a little bit squirrely before I jump off. <laughs> well, I think these guys here should definitely go. Come on out of here. Yeah, we'll, we'll get these out of here. Oh, I'm falling off. There we go. <laughs> okay, let's see. Do we have enough to fill this in? I hope so. We're going to walk over the top of these. Wow, you know what? Um, is there a grate that we could put across here? Security gate centered diagonal. Okay, that's not going to be the right thing. Well, maybe. Security gate plate. I'm thinking about doing these up here as, as the walkway. 
as opposed to the catwalk. What if I do something like that right there? No, it wouldn't. It wouldn't sit that way, huh? It would be this way. It would be this way. Your feet would. You would feet would go across all the, the slats. That gives us a quick passageway through here. When we're moving through between the flowers, we've used up all the flower beds that we had, so I think that's good. Let's go ahead and upgrade that all the way too. Nobody said both sides of the base had to look the same. No, nobody did. Uh, so I have ten of each, right? So... And then Goldenrod, I need six. I should really be focused on just doing Chrysanthemum in here. I don't think it would let me plant them if there was an issue with the lighting. Is that correct? Right, he's in the way a little bit there. There you go. Point, just like that. Okay, so now we got our flower garden down here, which is pretty cool. That's going to be nice as we come in, you know. Oh, man, it's been a rough zombie killing day, and you got, you know, these nice flowers growing over here, so that's a cool thing. All right, you know, you got to think about your mental sanity, too. Um, hold on a second. Let's see if there's anything we can do. I did want to look at these guys right here. Uh, copy shape, and we'll just, okay, copy rotation is already good. I'm thinking maybe we could get away with doing just to give that this side a little bit of that look of the other side. We we'll do something like that, and then what if we do, yeah, this guy right here. There probably is a, a, a round one. I don't know. Maybe there isn't. And you right there. And you right there. Bingo. Bongo boingo. I'm upgrading just about everything. Now, I have not gotten to the catwalk up above, and I don't know why. I have no excuse for that. But I'm sure someday it's going to come back and bite me in the butt. No, that shouldn't be that, huh? That should be that rusty metal, since it's outside. Gets wet and everything. There's the black rusty metal, and there's the metal tread plate. Oh, maybe the metal tread plate would look good. Yeah, that's good. That says, like, rebar and that kind of, kind of diamond plating and things of that nature. Rusty, because you walk over it so much. Uh, and then do we want to put... Um, what well, we, could, we could also do this now. Uh, let's go over here. Let's grab uh, this guy right here. Shape, and then the rotation. Do We, we could actually take this all the way across here. Pull the ground up like so. We'll just we're gonna we're gonna push this out a little bit just to see if we can get that ground to come up a little bit. You can see it's popping up a little bit here. Just to see if we can get it to meet up with this initial one a little bit nicer. Looks to me like it it's that helped it out, huh? It brought it up. There we go. And then we will go ahead and paint those. Uh, what do you think? I think the, probably the brick color would be the, the best choice. Maybe not. Maybe we'll find something different. But that's not the point. We set out to put our, our farm area above us. And we did manage to do that. We got a flower garden down here. It looks to me like it's going to grow just fine there. You know what? I could do... 
I could do this design along this wall here, too. Now that I really think about it. There we go. It's done. Flower garden in and growing. And that fits the base pretty darn good, I think. Let's go out here and take a look and see. Yeah, see? It's got just a little bit of that that little woodwork over there to match the other side. We've got this stretched out now, so you can tell. Yeah, it's not... Oh, that's... I've got a couple of blocks missing right there, right? That's my smallest wall of three. I had a three there for the entryway into the forge area. That's that's right. It's also the main entranceway from the garage into uh, the chem area and uh, the Jenny room for the lights. All right, sweet, 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 sweet. Okay, the farm is ready. Yeah, there's going to be something that's going to incorporate the landscape in front of our base here along this wall. There's going to be something here. Something's going to be here, and it's going to draw the zombies in. And then we're going to have, you know, we'll, we'll get rid of them. <laughs> hopefully. And then hopefully they don't get rid of us. Okay, so let me take a little break and figure out what I'm going to do next. Um, I, I think what I need to do is get those... Um, uh, other crop plots moved just like that and then they use the yellow on that over there for the posts safety right safety oh look at that we got a bike rack how cool is that it works out just great motorcycle sits nicely right there then we get the Jeep going uh, we'll be able to get the Jeep through here just fine just fine now I'm wondering <laughs> she keeps banging into the wall and stuff over here. I'm wondering if maybe I should um, do up the floor, the whole floor. I kind of like it being the wood, but at the same time, the wood wouldn't hold up too well to a Jeep driving on it. So I'm thinking about doing something else uh, in terms of what I'm going to paint it. I don't know yet. I don't know yet. Okay, so I'm done with all of the upgrading and stuff. I just need to put... You know what? I should keep that stuff in my inventory. I'm going to go up and get the farms plots moved. I'm, I'm again having a lot of lag issues right now today. Ever since I got on, it's just, um, it's very chuggy. And I mean, I, I've got a city right there. I know that, but it's not anything out over here that should be giving me any problems. There are quite, I, see, I don't know. Is it the trees? I, I must have a setting that I need to adjust or something. Maybe so. I don't think this is actually ready for picking, though. Yeah, this is not ready to go yet. Some of it might be, or getting close. It's supposed to be tonight, so it should be in just a couple hours that that's going to be done that way, and it should be finished up. Um, what do we think? I think I think we're good. We got our runway ready to go. How many points do we have? Let's take a look at our points and see. I've got four. Oh, boy. Intellect is where we're going. We're in Grease Monkey, and we're working our way to the Avionics Wizard. But before I even get to Avionics Wizard, I have to be at Intellect Level 10. I am at 9 right now, and to get to the next one is 3 points. That will get me there. I'm not actually there, because I'm wearing the glasses, so those are helping me. But if I do that, I can get that. Mastermind is three points as well. But if I come over to Grease Monkey now, I can open this one, and this is going to be n next. And now if I get one more point, I can, I can buy the Gyrocopter, and we can make the Gyrocopter. So i got to think that's going to be coming in the next episode, or the one after that. But, oh my gosh, I'm one point away, huh? Uh, you know what? I grab that concrete. I could go upgrade the entire outer wall at least a bunch of it, or the, I mean, the moat. I've got spikes that need to be made. Oh, this might not be a bad idea. We could get our, get possibly our, our stuff. Can I pick her up? I don't mean to think she's, she's awful, but. I'll be here if you need me. Thank you. Okay. Yeah. I'm going to put her away because that hum gets to me after a little while. She's got that. It's just that it's a faint little hum, but it's it's there. Oh, I need to make some more uh, chrysanthemum tea too. Yes, I do. Um, 
Okay, so uh, yeah, I've got a few chores I got to do here as well tonight. Uh, let's go ahead and water. Boiled water. Okay, we have more spikes being made. Open sesame. Do we have any zombies? I don't see any. I don't know how the forges going though either. So yeah, we're going to just go ahead and do the bottom row right here. That's fine. They'll walk into them and get snagged on them, which is just great. It gives me a little bit of heads up, and they're already damaged when I come out here. I have a couple hundred more of these being made. Uh, even if, you know, we don't need them right away, we're going to have to replace some of these on a regular basis. Either that, or I come out with wood and fix them. But it never ends. Eventually, uh, some of them, you know, disappear. Oh, jeez. All these need to be repaired, it seems like. <laughs> the outer wall doesn't matter. It's this inner wall we got to worry about. They work. Look at there. That's good. Well, you can see, I'm going to lose some now. But that's okay. Eventually, we can... What we should do is upgrade them to iron right off the bat. We've got the resources to do it. Yeah, you know, there's a large chunk of this wall that has suffered damage. There's not a, almost a single one of these that hasn't been damaged. There we go. All right, better. All better. Look at that. Nice. Now we've got that center block at least protected to, you know, hopefully... Hopefully it's going to be a good thing. It's needed. It's already upgraded. That's right, because I upgraded it from the inside, and then I painted it back to the way it was supposed to be. Looks good to me. I think we've got it all the way around. I don't know why I'm not doing this part right here. I think I was low on concrete, maybe. Not anymore. Oh, what's that was damaged. Eventually, these are going to have to be steel right down in here. It would be cool to have the entire wall, inner wall, be steel. All right. All right. I'll be back. Let's go ahead and make one of these. We're not going to use it yet, but we'll have it. And then steel garage door 5x3. That's going to take some steel, huh? Okay, so let's grab the steel as well. I got 187. Hmm. Steel garage door. I need two of those. There we go. Awesome. So we've got the doors BB. Now, can I make the... Um, it's not... I was thinking camera. Uh, sensor? Motion sensor. There it is, right there. I can. I can craft some of those, too. Let's... I think I've got one. Let's craft five of those. Uh, we're going to need some more... Uh, can I make the electric fence? I can make the electric fence post. Let's make four of those. All right. And then we're going to have all this stuff ready to go. Can I make blade traps? A blade trap. I can. Uh, I need oil. Oil. Blade trap. Let's make uh, let's make four of those as well. And then I think oh what 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 do I need for uh, the um, SMG turret? Okay, I don't have. Okay, I don't have that. So what about the shotgun turret? I do. I've got this one. Uh, okay, I need motion sensors for that. Hmm. So let's make a couple more of those. And then we can make that shotgun turret. We'll make two of those. Oh, I need shotgun parts as well. Okay, uh, pieces and parts. Uh-oh. Huh. Wonder why those boxes lost their paint. 
That doesn't make any sense to me at all. You know that? Doesn't make sense to me. Hmm. Wow, that's really that's really weird. I need my blocks. Is it possible I painted them while I was doing something else outside? Perfect. Okay, that's... that's better. What was I looking for? Um... okay, that's got stuff in it. That's... should have stuff in it. Okay, that does have stuff in it. Okay, okay, okay. Whew. For a second, I thought I lost a bunch of stuff. I've only got four shotgun parts. Ooh. You know what I think? I think that's what we kind of talked about saving that one shotgun that we were talking about selling. That's going to be pipes. It's not going to be what we're looking for when it comes to shotguns. I've got the for sale stuff here. I think I need to scrap this guy. I'll get three shotgun parts out of him, so I'll have one left. So then I'll be able to at least make uh, both of those shotgun turrets. Because the shotgun turrets are a good time. They're just a lot of fun. And one of you was right. We do need to kind of get started on what we're going to do out there in terms of uh, protection for us. So that's going to take an eternity and a day. And that's going to take, oh wow, 21 minutes to make those doors. So it's going to be a bit of a tick before those are even done. Okay. All right, well, well, now I know. Now I know. Okay, I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. If you did, I would appreciate it very much if you'd hit that like button for me. Comment, subscribe, and share. I'm the Radio Man 03. I want you to have an awesome, a fantastic, and a superb day. And I look forward to talking to you again next time. Power up complete. Thanks, Variety.